This page is about reciprocity theorems in classical electromagnetism. See also reciprocity theorem disambiguation for unrelated reciprocity theorems, and reciprocity disambiguation for more general usages of the term. In classical electromagnetism, reciprocity refers to a variety of related theorems involving the interchange of time harmonic electric current densities sources and the resulting electromagnetic fields in Maxwell's equations for time invariant linear media under certain constraints. Reciprocity is closely related to the concept of Hermitian operators from linear algebra, applied to electromagnetism. Perhaps the most common and general such theorem is Lorentz reciprocity and its various special cases such as rayleigh carson reciprocity, named after work by Hendrik Lorentz in 1896 following analogous results regarding sound by Lord Rayleigh and light by Helmholtz Potten, 2004. Loosely, it states that the relationship between an oscillating current and the resulting electric field is unchanged if one interchanges the points where the current is placed and where the field is measured. For the specific case of an electrical network, it is sometimes phrased as the statement that voltages and currents at different points in the network can be interchanged. More technically, it follows that the mutual impedance of a first circuit due to a second is the same as the mutual impedance of the second circuit due to the first. Reciprocity is useful in optics, which apart from quantum effects can be expressed in terms of classical electromagnetism, but also in terms of radiometry. There is also an analogous theorem in electrostatics, known as Green's reciprocity, relating the interchange of electric potential and electric charge density. Forms of the reciprocity theorems are used in many electromagnetic applications, such as analyzing electrical networks and antenna systems. For example, reciprocity implies that antennas work equally well as transmitters or receivers, and specifically that an antenna's radiation and receiving patterns are identical. Reciprocity is also a basic lemma that is used to prove other theorems about electromagnetic systems, such as the symmetry of the impedance matrix and scattering matrix, symmetries of Green's functions for use in boundary element and transfer matrix computational methods, as well as orthogonality properties of harmonic modes in waveguide systems as an alternative to proving those properties directly from the symmetries of the eigenoperators. Topic. Lorentz reciprocity Specifically, suppose that one has a current density J 1 display style math bf j underscore 1 that produces an electric field E 1 display style math bf E underscore 1 and a magnetic field H 1 Display style math bf h underscore one, where all three are periodic functions of time with angular frequency omega, and in particular they have time dependence. Exp minus i omega t. Display style exp i omega t. Suppose that we similarly have a second current j two. Display style math bf j underscore two at the same frequency omega which by itself produces fields e two display style math bf e underscore two and h two display style math bf h underscore two the Lorentz reciprocity theorem then states, under certain simple conditions on the materials of the medium described below, that for an arbitrary surface S enclosing a volume 5 V J 1 E 2 minus E 1 J 2 D V equals S E 1 times h 2 minus e 2 times h 1 d s Display style int underscore V left Math BF J underscore one C D O T Math BF E underscore two Math BF E underscore one C D O T Math BF J underscore two right D V equals oint underscore S left Math BF E underscore one times Math BF H underscore two Math BF E underscore two times Math BF H underscore one right C D O T Math BF D S
equivalently in differential form by the divergence theorem j 1 e 2 minus e 1 j 2 equals e 1 times h 2 minus e 2 times h 1 Display style Math BF J underscore one C D O T Math BF E underscore two Math BF E underscore one C D O T Math BF J underscore two equals Nabla C D O T left Math BF E underscore one times Math BF H underscore two Math BF E underscore two times Math BF H underscore one right. This general form is commonly simplified for a number of special cases. In particular, one usually assumes that j one display style math bf j underscore one and j two display style math bf j underscore two are localized, i.e., have compact support, and that there are no incoming waves from infinitely far away. In this case, if one integrates throughout space, then the surface integral terms cancel. See below, and one obtains j 1 e 2 d v equals e 1 j 2 d v display style int math bf j underscore 1 c d o t math bf e underscore 2 d v equals int math bf e underscore 1 c d o t math bf j underscore 2 d v this result along with the following simplifications is sometimes called the rayleigh carson reciprocity theorem after lord rayleigh's work on sound waves and an extension by john r carson 1924 1930 to applications for radio frequency antennas Often, one further simplifies this relation by considering point-like dipole sources, in which case the integrals disappear and one simply has the product of the electric field with the corresponding dipole moments of the currents. Or, for wires of negligible thickness, one obtains the applied current in one wire multiplied by the resulting voltage across another and vice versa, see also below. Another special case of the Lorentz reciprocity theorem applies when the volume 5 entirely contains both of the localized sources or alternatively if V intersects neither of the sources. In this case S E 1 times H 2 D S equals S E 2 times H one D S Display style oint underscore S Math BF E underscore one times Math BF H underscore two C D O T Math BF D S equals oint underscore S Math BF E underscore two times Math BF H underscore one C D O T Math BF D S Topic Reciprocity for electrical networks Above, Lorentz reciprocity was phrased in terms of an externally applied current source and the resulting field. Often, especially for electrical networks, one instead prefers to think of an externally applied voltage and the resulting currents. The Lorentz reciprocity theorem describes this case as well, assuming ohmic materials i.e. currents that respond linearly to the applied field with a 3 times 3 conductivity matrix sigma that is required to be symmetric, which is implied by the other conditions below. In order to properly describe this situation, one must carefully distinguish between the externally applied fields from the driving voltages and the total fields that result King, 1963. More specifically, the J Display style math bf j above only consisted of external source terms introduced into Maxwell's equations. We now denote this by j e display style math bf j caret e to distinguish it from the total current produced by both the external source and by the resulting electric fields in the materials. If this external current is in a material with a conductivity sigma, then it corresponds to an externally applied electric field 
E E Display style Math BF E carrot E where by definition of sigma J E equals Sigma E E Display style Math BF J carrot E equals Sigma Math BF E carrot E Moreover, the electric field E Display style Math BF E above only consisted of the response to this current and did not include the external field E E Display style Math BF E carrot E Therefore, we now denote the field from before as E R Display style Math BF E carrot R where the total field is given by E equals E E plus E R Display style Math BF E equals Math BF E carrot E plus Math BF E carrot R now, the equation on the left-hand side of the Lorentz reciprocity theorem can be rewritten by moving the sigma from the external current term. J E display style math BF J caret E to the response field terms E R display style math BF E caret R and also adding and subtracting a sigma E one E E two E display style sigma math BF E underscore one carrot E math BF E underscore two carrot E term to obtain the external field multiplied by the total current J equals sigma E display style math BF J equals sigma math BF E V J one E E two R minus E one R J two E D V equals V Sigma E one E E two R plus E two E minus E one R plus E one E Sigma E two E D V equals V E one E J two minus J one E two E D V display style begin aligned and int underscore V left Math BF J underscore one carrot E C D O T Math BF E underscore two carrot R Math BF E underscore one carrot R C D O T Math BF J underscore two carrot E right D V equals and int underscore V left Sigma Math BF E underscore one carrot E C D O T left Math BF E underscore two carrot R plus Math BF E underscore two carrot E right left Math BF E underscore one carrot R plus Math BF E underscore one carrot E right C D O T Sigma Math BF E underscore two carrot E right D V equals and int underscore V left Math BF E underscore one carrot E C D O T Math BF J underscore two Math BF J underscore one C D O T Math BF E underscore two carrot E right dv n aligned for the limit of thin wires this gives the product of the externally applied voltage 1 multiplied by the resulting total current 2 and vice versa in particular the rayleigh carson reciprocity theorem becomes a simple summation n v 1 n i 2 n equals n v 2 N I one N 
Display style sum underscore n v underscore one carrot n i underscore two carrot n equals sum underscore n v underscore two carrot n i underscore one carrot n, where v and i denote the complex amplitudes of the AC applied voltages and the resulting currents, respectively, in a set of circuit elements indexed by n for two possible sets of voltages v one display style v underscore one and V two display style V underscore two. Most commonly, this is simplified further to the case where each system has a single voltage source V at V one one equals V display style V underscore one carrot one equals V and V two two equals V display style V underscore two carrot two equals V. Then the theorem becomes simply I one two equals I two one display style I underscore one carrot two equals I underscore two carrot one. Or in words. The current at position 1 from a voltage at 2 is identical to the current at 2 from the same voltage at 1. Topic: <laughs> Conditions and proof of Lorentz reciprocity. The Lorentz reciprocity theorem is simply a reflection of the fact that the linear operator O caret display style hat O relating J display style math BF J and e display style math BF e at a fixed frequency Omega display style Omega in linear media J equals 1 I Omega 1 mu times times minus omega 2 epsilon e o caret e display style math bf j equals frac 1 i omega left frac 1 mu left nabla times nabla times right omega caret 2 ver epsilon right math bf e equivalent hat o math bf e is usually a symmetric operator under the inner product F G equals F G D V display style math BF F math BF G equals int math BF F C D O T math BF G D V for vector fields F display style math BF F and G display style math BF G Technically, this unconjugated form is not a true inner product because it is not real valued for complex valued fields, but that is not a problem here. In this sense, the operator is not truly Hermitian but is rather complex symmetric. This is true whenever the permittivity epsilon and the magnetic permeability mu at the given omega are symmetric 3 times 3 matrices, symmetric rank 2 tensors. This includes the common case where they are scalars for isotropic media, of course. They need not be real Complex values correspond to materials with losses, such as conductors with finite conductivity sigma, which is included in epsilon via epsilon epsilon plus i sigma omega display style ver epsilon right arrow ver epsilon plus i sigma omega, and because of this, the reciprocity theorem does not require time reversal invariance. The condition of symmetric epsilon and mu matrices is almost always satisfied, see below for an exception. For any Hermitian operator O carrot display style hat O under an inner product F G display style F G we have F O carrot G equals O carrot F G 
Display style f hat o g equals hat o f g. By definition, and the Rayleigh-Carson reciprocity theorem is merely the vectorial version of this statement for this particular operator. J equals o caret e. Display style math bf j equals hat o math bf e. That is e one o carrot e two equals o carrot e one e two display style math bf e underscore one hat o math bf e underscore two equals hat o math bf e underscore one math bf e underscore two the Hermitian property of the operator here can be derived by integration by parts. For a finite integration volume, the surface terms from this integration by parts yield the more general surface integral theorem above. In particular, the key fact is that, for vector fields f and g Integration by parts or the divergence theorem over a volume 5 enclosed by a surface S gives the identity V F times G D V V times F G D V minus S F times G D A display style int underscore v math bf f c d o t nabla times math bf g d v equivalent int underscore v nabla times math bf f c d o t math bf g d v oint underscore s math bf f times math bf g c d o t math bf dar. This identity is then applied twice to e one. O carrot E two Display style Math BF E underscore one hat O Math BF E underscore two to yield O carrot E one E two Display style hat O Math BF E underscore one Math BF E underscore two plus the surface term, giving the Lorentz reciprocity relation. Conditions and proof of Lorentz reciprocity using Maxwell's equations and vector operations way shall prove a general form of the electromagnetic reciprocity theorem due to Lorentz which states that fields E 1 H 1 display style math bf E underscore 1 math bf H underscore 1 and E 2 h 2 display style math bf e underscore 2 math bf h underscore 2 generated by two different sinusoidal current densities respectively j 1 display style math bf j underscore 1 and j 2 display style math bf j underscore 2 of the same frequency satisfy the condition v j 1 e 2 minus e 1 j 2 d v equals s e 1 times h 2 minus e 2 times h 1 d s Display style int underscore V left Math BF J underscore one C D O T Math BF E underscore two Math BF E underscore one C D O T Math BF J underscore two right D V equals oint underscore S left Math BF E underscore one times Math BF H underscore two Math BF E underscore two times Math BF H underscore one right C D O T Math BF D S 
Let us take a region in which dielectric constant and permeability may be functions of position but not of time. Maxwell's equations, written in terms of the total fields, currents and charges of the region describe the electromagnetic behavior of the region. The two curl equations are, times E equals minus BT, times H equals J plus DT, display style, begin, array, CCC, nabla, times, math BF, E, and equals and, frac, partial, math BF, B, partial T, nabla, times, math BF, H, and equals and, math BF, J, plus, frac, partial, math BF, D, partial T. End array under steady constant frequency conditions we get from the two curl equations the Maxwell's equations for the time periodic case times e equals minus j omega b times h equals j plus j omega d display style begin array c c c nabla times math b f e and equals and j omega math b f b nabla times math b f h and equals and math b f j plus j omega math b f d end array it must be recognized that the symbols in the equations of this article represent the complex multipliers of e j omega t display style e caret j omega t giving the in phase and out of phase parts with respect to the chosen reference the complex vector multipliers of e j omega t display style e caret j omega t may be called vector phases by analogy to the complex scalar quantities which are commonly referred to as phases. An equivalence of vector operations shows that h times e minus e times h equals e times h Display style Math BF H C D O T Nabla times Math BF E Math BF E C D O T Nabla times Math BF H equals Nabla C D O T Math BF E times Math BF H For every vectors E Display style Math BF E and H Display style Math BF H If we apply this equivalence to E one display style math bf e underscore one and h two display style math bf h underscore two we get h two times e one minus e one times h two equals e 1 times h 2 display style math bf h underscore 2 c d o t nabla times math bf e underscore 1 math bf e underscore 1 c d o t nabla times math bf h underscore 2 equals nabla c d o t math bf e underscore 1 times math bf h underscore 2 if products in the time periodic equations are taken as indicated by this last equivalence and added minus h 2 j omega b 1 minus e 1 j omega d 2 minus e 1 J two equals E one times H two Display style Math BF H underscore two C D O T J Omega Math BF B underscore one Math BF E underscore one C D O T J Omega Math BF D underscore two Math BF E underscore one C D O T Math BF J underscore two equals Nabla C D O T Math BF E underscore one times Math BF H underscore two. This now may be integrated over the volume of concern V h 2 j omega b 1 plus e 1 j omega d 2 plus e 1 j 2 d v equals minus V 
e 1 times h 2 d v display style int underscore v math bf h underscore 2 c d o t j omega math bf b underscore 1 plus math bf e underscore 1 c d o t j omega math bf d underscore 2 plus math bf e underscore 1 math bf j underscore 2 d v equals int underscore v nabla c d o t math bf e underscore 1 times math bf h underscore 2 d v from the divergence theorem the volume integral of d i v e 1 times h 2 display style div math bf e underscore 1 times math bf h underscore 2 equals the surface integral of e 1 times h 2 Display style math bf e underscore one times math bf h underscore two over the boundary v h two j omega b one plus e one j omega d two plus e 1 j 2 d v equals minus s e 1 times h 2 d s caret Display style int underscore v math bf h underscore two c d o t j omega math bf b underscore one plus math bf e underscore one c d o t j omega math bf d underscore two plus math bf e underscore one c d o t math bf j underscore two d v equals oint underscore s math bf e underscore one times math bf h underscore two c d o t wide hat d s this form is valid for general media, but in the common case of linear, isotropic, time invariant materials, E display style epsilon is a scalar independent of time. Then generally as physical magnitudes D equals E display style math BF D equals epsilon math BF E and B equals mu H Display style math bf b equals mu math bf h. Last equation then becomes v h two j omega mu h one plus e one j omega e two plus E one J two D V equals minus S E one times H two D S carrot Display style int underscore v math bf h underscore two c d o t j omega mu math bf h underscore one plus math bf e underscore one c d o t j omega epsilon math bf e underscore two plus math bf e underscore one c d o t math bf j underscore two d v equals oint underscore s math bf e underscore one times math bf h underscore two c d o t wide hat d s in an exactly analogous way we get for vectors e 2 display style math bf e underscore 2 and h 1 display style math bf h underscore 1 the following expression v h 1 j omega mu h 2 plus e 
2 j omega e 1 plus e 2 j 1 d v equals minus s e 2 times h 1 d s carrot display style int underscore v math bf h underscore one c d o t j omega mu math bf h underscore two plus math bf e underscore two c d o t j omega epsilon math bf e underscore one plus math bf e underscore two c d o t math bf j underscore one d v equals oint underscore s math bf e underscore two times math bf h underscore one c d o t wide hat d s Subtracting the two last equations by members we get V J 1 E 2 minus E 1 J 2 D V equals S E 1 times H 2 minus e 2 times h 1 d s Display style int underscore v left math bf j underscore one c d o t math bf e underscore two math bf e underscore one c d o t math bf j underscore two right d v equals oint underscore s left math bf e underscore one times math bf h underscore two math bf e underscore two times math bf h underscore one right c d o t math bf d s and equivalently in differential form j 1 e 2 minus e 1 j 2 equals e 1 times h 2 minus e 2 times h 1 Display style Math BF J underscore one C D O T Math BF E underscore two Math BF E underscore one C D O T Math BF J underscore two equals Nabla C D O T left Math BF E underscore one times Math BF H underscore two Math BF E underscore two times Math BF H underscore one right Q E D Topic: Surface term cancellation. The cancellation of the surface terms on the right-hand side of the Lorentz reciprocity theorem for an integration over all space is not entirely obvious, but can be derived in a number of ways. The simplest general argument comes from a straightforward application of the divergence theorem for localized sources. One can choose the bounding surface S. Display style S such that it contains all sources. This bounding surface is also a bounding surface reversing the unit normal vector for the complementary region of space going out to infinity v c display style v underscore c containing no sources. The reciprocity relation thus still holds v c j 1 e 2 minus e 1 j 2 d v equals minus s e 1 times h 2 minus e 2 times h 1 D S D 
Display style int underscore V underscore C left Math BF J underscore one C D O T Math BF E underscore two Math BF E underscore one C D O T Math BF J underscore two right D V equals oint underscore S left Math BF E underscore one times Math BF H underscore two Math BF E underscore two times Math BF H underscore one right C D O T Math BF D S with the replacement v v c display style v right arrow v underscore c and a negative sign for the unit normal the left hand side of the expression is zero because there are no sources in v c display style v underscore c and thus the right hand side is zero as well another simple argument would be that the fields goes to zero at infinity for a localized source but this argument fails in the case of lossless media in the absence of absorption radiated fields decay inversely with distance but the surface area of the integral increases with the square of distance so the two rates balance one another in the integral instead it is common eg king 1963 to assume that the medium is homogeneous and isotropic sufficiently far away in this case, the radiated field asymptotically takes the form of plane waves propagating radially outward in the R caret display style hat math bf R direction with R caret e equals zero display style hat math bf R c d o t math bf e equals zero and h equals R carrot times E Z Display style Math BF H equals hat Math BF R times Math BF E Z where Z is the impedance mu E display style SQRT mu epsilon of the surrounding medium. Then it follows that E one times H two equals E one times R carrot times E two Z Display style Math BF E underscore one times Math BF H underscore two equals Math BF E underscore one times hat Math BF R times Math BF E underscore two Z which by a simple vector identity equals R carrot E one E two Z Display style hat Math BF R Math BF E underscore one C D O T Math BF E underscore two Z Similarly E two times H one equals R carrot E two E one Z Display style Math BF E underscore two times Math BF H underscore one equals hat Math BF R Math BF E underscore two C D O T Math BF E underscore one Z and the two terms cancel one another. The above argument shows explicitly why the surface terms can cancel, but lacks generality. Alternatively, one can treat the case of lossless surrounding media by taking the limit as the losses the imaginary part of epsilon go to zero. For any non-zero loss, the fields decay exponentially with distance and the surface integral vanishes, regardless of whether the medium is homogeneous. Since the left-hand side of the Lorentz reciprocity theorem vanishes for integration over all space with any non-zero losses, it must also vanish in the limit as the losses go to zero. Note that we implicitly assumed the standard boundary condition of zero incoming waves from infinity, because otherwise even an infinitesimal loss would eliminate the incoming waves and the limit would not give the lossless solution. Topic. Reciprocity and the Green's function. The inverse of the operator O carrot display style hat O IE in E equals O carrot minus one 
J Display style Math BF E equals hat O carrot minus one Math BF J which requires a specification of the boundary conditions at infinity in a lossless system, has the same symmetry as O carrot display style hat O and is essentially a Green's function convolution. So, another perspective on Lorentz reciprocity is that it reflects the fact that convolution with the electromagnetic Green's function is a complex symmetric or anti-hermitian below linear operation under the appropriate conditions on epsilon and mu. More specifically, the Green's function can be written as g n m x x display style g underscore nanometer math bf x math bf x giving the nth component of e display style math bf e at x display style math bf x from a point dipole current in the mth direction at x display style math bf x essentially g display style g gives the matrix elements of o caret minus 1 display style hat o caret minus 1 and rayleigh carson reciprocity is equivalent to the statement that g n m x x equals g m n x x display style g underscore nanometer math bf x math bf x equals g underscore minnesota math bf x math bf x unlike o caret display style hat o it is not generally possible to give an explicit formula for the Green's function except in special cases such as homogeneous media, but it is routinely computed by numerical methods. Topic. Lossless magneto-optic materials One case in which epsilon is not a symmetric matrix is for magneto-optic materials, in which case the usual statement of Lorentz reciprocity does not hold see below for a generalization, however. If we allow magneto-optic materials, but restrict ourselves to the situation where material absorption is negligible, then epsilon and mu are in general 3 times 3 complex Hermitian matrices. In this case, the operator 1 mu times times minus omega 2 c 2 epsilon display style frac 1 mu left nabla times nabla times right frac omega caret 2 c caret 2 ver epsilon is hermitian under the conjugated inner product f g equals f g d v Display style math bf f math bf g equals int math bf f caret asterisk c d o t math bf g d v, and a variant of the reciprocity theorem still holds. Minus v j one e two plus e one j two d V equals S E one times H two plus E two times H one D A Display style int underscore V left Math BF J underscore one carrot asterisk C D O T Math BF E underscore two plus Math BF E underscore one carrot asterisk C D O T Math BF J underscore two right D V equals oint underscore S left Math BF E underscore one carrot asterisk times Math BF H underscore two plus Math BF E underscore two times Math BF H underscore one carrot asterisk right C D O T Math BF da where the sign changes come from the one I Omega Display style one I Omega 
in the equation above, which makes the operator O carrot display style hat O anti-hermitian neglecting surface terms. For the special case of J one equals J two display style math bf j underscore one equals math bf j underscore two this gives a restatement of conservation of energy or pointing's theorem since here we have assumed lossless materials unlike above the time average rate of work done by the current given by the real part of minus j e display style math bf j caret asterisk c dot math bf e is equal to the time average outward flux of power the integral of the pointing vector. By the same token, however, the surface terms do not in general vanish if one integrates over all space for this reciprocity variant, so a Rayleigh-Carson form does not hold without additional assumptions. The fact that magneto-optic materials break Rayleigh-Carson reciprocity is the key to devices such as Faraday isolators and circulators. A current on one side of a Faraday isolator produces a field on the other side but not vice versa. Topic. Generalization to non-symmetric materials For a combination of lossy and magneto-optic materials, and in general when the epsilon and mu tenses are neither symmetric nor Hermitian matrices, one can still obtain a generalized version of Lorentz reciprocity by considering J 1 E 1 Display style math bf j underscore one math bf e underscore one and j two e two display style math bf j underscore two math bf e underscore two to exist in different systems. In particular, if j one e one Display style math bf j underscore one math bf e underscore one satisfy Maxwell's equations at omega for a system with materials epsilon one mu one display style var epsilon underscore one mu underscore one and j two e two Display style math bf j underscore two math bf e underscore two satisfy Maxwell's equations at omega for a system with materials epsilon one t mu one t display style left for epsilon underscore one carrot t mu underscore one carrot t right where T denotes the transpose, then the equation of Lorentz reciprocity holds. This can be further generalized to bi anisotropic materials by transposing the full 6 times 6 susceptibility tensor. Topic. Exceptions to reciprocity For nonlinear media, no reciprocity theorem generally holds. Reciprocity also does not generally apply for time varying active media, for example, when epsilon is modulated in time by some external process. In both of these cases, the frequency omega is not generally a conserved quantity. <laughs> Feld-tie reciprocity A closely related reciprocity theorem was articulated independently by Y. A. Feld and C. T. Tai in 1992 and is known as Feld-Tie reciprocity or the Feld-Tie lemma. It relates two time harmonic localized current sources and the resulting magnetic fields J 1 H 2 D V equals H 1 J 2 d v display style int math bf j underscore 1 c d o t math bf h underscore 2 d v equals int math bf h underscore 1 c d o t math bf j underscore 2 d v. However, the Feld-Tie lemma is only valid under much more restrictive conditions than Lorentz reciprocity. 
It generally requires time invariant linear media with an isotropic homogeneous impedance, i.e., a constant scalar mu epsilon ratio, with the possible exception of regions of perfectly conducting material. More precisely, Feld tie reciprocity requires the Hermitian or rather, complex symmetric symmetry of the electromagnetic operators as above, but also relies on the assumption that the operator relating E display style math BF E and I Omega J display style I Omega math BF J is a constant scalar multiple of the operator relating H display style math bf h and times j epsilon display style nabla times math bf j ver epsilon which is true when epsilon is a constant scalar multiple of mu the two operators generally differ by an interchange of epsilon and mu as above one can also construct a more general formulation for integrals over a finite volume Topic optical reciprocity in radiometric terms Apart from quantal effects, classical theory covers near, middle, and far field electric and magnetic phenomena with arbitrary time courses. Optics refers to far field nearly sinusoidal oscillatory electromagnetic effects. Instead of paired electric and magnetic variables, optics, including optical reciprocity, can be expressed in polarization paired radiometric variables, such as spectral radiance, traditionally called specific intensity. In 1856, Hermann von Helmholtz wrote, a ray of light proceeding from point A arrives at point B after suffering any number of refractions, reflections, and C. At point A let any two perpendicular planes A1, A2 be taken in the direction of the ray, and let the vibrations of the ray be divided into two parts, one in each of these planes. Take like planes B1, B2 in the ray at point B, then the following proposition may be demonstrated. If when the quantity of light J polarized in the plane A1 proceeds from A in the direction of the given ray, that part K thereof of light polarized in B1 arrives at B, then, conversely, if the quantity of light J polarized in B1 proceeds from B, the same quantity of light K polarized in A1 will arrive at A, this is sometimes called the Helmholtz reciprocity or reversion principle. When the wave propagates through a material acted upon by an applied magnetic field, reciprocity can be broken so this principle will not apply. When there are moving objects in the path of the ray, the principle may be entirely inapplicable. Historically, in 1849, Sir George Stokes stated his optical reversion principle without attending to polarization. Like the principles of thermodynamics, this principle is reliable enough to use as a check on the correct performance of experiments. In contrast with the usual situation in which the experiments are tests of a proposed law, the most extremely simple statement of the principle is if I can see you, then you can see me. The principle was used by Gustav Kirchhoff in his derivation of his law of thermal radiation and by Max Planck in his analysis of his law of thermal radiation. For ray tracing global illumination algorithms, incoming and outgoing light can be considered as reversals of each other, without affecting the bidirectional reflectance distribution function BRDF outcome. Topic. Green's reciprocity. Whereas the above reciprocity theorems were for oscillating fields, Green's reciprocity is an analogous theorem for electrostatics with a fixed distribution of electric charge Panofsky and Phillips, 1962. In particular, let phi 1 display style phi underscore 1 denote the electric potential resulting from a total charge density rho 1 display style rho underscore 1 the electric potential satisfies Poisson's equation minus 2 phi 1 equals rho 1 epsilon 0 display style nabla carrot 2 phi underscore 1 equals rho underscore 1 ver epsilon underscore 0 where epsilon 0 Display style ver epsilon underscore zero is the vacuum permittivity. Similarly, let phi two display style phi underscore two denote the electric potential resulting from a total charge density rho two display style rho underscore two satisfying minus two 
phi two equals rho two epsilon zero display style nabla carrot two phi underscore two equals rho underscore two var epsilon underscore zero in both cases, we assume that the charge distributions are localized, so that the potentials can be chosen to go to zero at infinity. Then, Green's reciprocity theorem states that, for integrals over all space, rho 1 phi 2 d v equals rho 2 phi 1 d v Display style int row underscore one phi underscore two dv equals int row underscore two phi underscore one dv. This theorem is easily proven from Green's second identity. Equivalently, it is the statement that phi two two phi one d v equals phi one two phi 2 d v display style int phi underscore 2 nabla carrot 2 phi underscore 1 dv equals int phi underscore 1 nabla carrot 2 phi underscore 2 dv ie that 2 display style nabla carrot 2 is a hermitian operator as follows by integrating by parts twice <laughs> 